Hey y'all, it's Nikea here. It is the next day. I'm sitting in my car after work trying to get it to warm up. So if you hear the AC in the background or hear a noise, it's the AC in the background. Um, today was my first day back to work after almost two weeks. Um, that's gonna be a story time for another day. <laughs> I'm gonna share that with y'all. Um, but yeah, my first day back in a few weeks, it was a little weird because you know, I'm a teacher. I've been gone for so long that I now felt like the sub, which was crazy. But yeah, everything seems to work out smoothly. It's exam week, so it's pretty chill. I, yeah, I'm tired. I am tired. But yeah, I'm about to go pick up my daughter and my nephew from daycare. <sighs> but yeah, my day went pretty smoothly. I don't know if I can say I'm glad to be back. I think I just still need breasts. Like I'm, it was mentally draining today. I'll say that. Mentally draining. Yeah. But it's all good. But I'm going to go home and unwind. I think I'm gonna have a glass of wine and some popcorn. I thought I was gonna make the gingerbread house with Harper yesterday, but I don't have, um, I didn't have time to do that. So I will probably save that for one of the days that I'm off work and uh, yeah, but I am going to wrap her presents today. So the rest of her presents came from Amazon. So I guess I'll do like a, Christmas shopping gift haul for Harper and y'all can wrap those presents with me and that'll be it for today so yeah I'm gonna focus on driving listen to my audiobook and I'll see y'all back at the house okay y'all I'm here I'm gonna show you like a little haul of what I got all right so this is just super informal y'all can see my face yes it's me. I'm back um, so this is just gonna be super casual and formal. Um, so I just bought this stuff with, like last week and it's most of it's here from Amazon. The only thing missing is one pair of her sneakers. But um, like I said before in a previous video, so my husband sent me this uh, graphic that he saw on the internet, which I've seen it before, but he, we made the decision that we were gonna use this to buy gifts um, for our girls. So he bought everything for Reagan um, our 10 year old and I bought everything for Harper our three-year-old right, so the graphic says for Christmas for your children so you don't get excessive and buy them too many things you get them something they want something they need something to wear and something to read all right so Harper got a little bit extra but I'll explain so like I said she's three years old um, I feel like Harper is pretty um, advanced in her age like she's a quick learner and she has really good memory um so she's really interested in electronics and like the iPad and the phone and stuff like that but her father specifically doesn't want her on the iPad he just feels some type of way about her being on that so I found this as a consolation for her <laughs> and for him he's cool with this this is the leak pad ultimate it is a school readiness tablet. It comes with 25 plus apps and access to over a thousand learning games, videos, eBooks, and more. So it, um, coming on here, it has the uh, Learning Friends Preschool and it also has the ability to help you get ready for kindergarten. It has personalized learning with auto leveling tutorials, which I don't know, I think I'll wrap this in this. Yeah, there's 10 preschool, um, kindergarten apps, Wi-Fi capabilities, up to six hour battery. It has two cameras for photos and videos, Leap Search web browser that's kids safe, music player with 15 songs. I think this is really good. And then on the back it has some, you know, characters she's familiar with, so hopefully these are up here. 
um it comes in pink and then like a green the typical leapfrog color like the green and uh blue but this one's pink and purple harper likes the color purple and i like the fact that it customizes learning from her i bought this off of amazon this was about 76 dollars i like the fact that it has a rechargeable battery so we're not going to just put her on that all the time but yeah i think that's her most expensive gift and then for something to read, I got her Lupita and Yogo Sulwe. And I got her this book because <sighs> when I was giving Harper a bath, I just noticed Harper's complexion is darker than mine. Because um, her dad has a deeper complexion than I do. So like I was saying, I don't ever want Harper to compare herself to me and be like, oh, my mom's lighter, so she's prettier and not like her skin complexion. So I just want to start now, like empowering her, letting her know that she is beautiful because I don't know what her final skin complexion is going to be and she may get darker because kids play out in the sun and, you know, her lower body is darker than her face. So I just, I don't know, you know, and, you know, EJ is of a darker complexion and I think it's beautiful and I just want Harper to know that her complexion is um, beautiful. And, I, and even if kids may tease her about it or if somebody says something negative, she's already been instilled with words from me and from her father to know that her skin is beautiful. She is beautiful no matter what her skin tone is. And I watched the interview that Lupita did with Oprah um, talking about this book and the process that she went through with learning and loving herself. And also to see like a beautiful dark skinned child with short curly hair is important and I was also thinking about writing a note in the front to Harper she won't be able to read it now but I think I'm gonna write a note in the front to her and this book is just so beautifully illustrated look at this this is beautiful who illustrated this Bashai Harrison beautiful illustrations all right, on the something to wear front, Harper got several things on something to wear, but I got her a bathrobe. So when she comes out the bathroom, she don't have to be naked because <laughs> Harper's like to be naked. And also something she can wear around the house. So a similar texture to the robes that EJ and I have. And it comes with the hood. And I got her the elephant because she has an elephant towel that she's had since she was like a baby. So, you know, and you know, I'm into elephants because of my sorority. <laughs> This just came today. Oh. This is another something that she wanted. Harper wanted a Mickey Mouse kitchen. Or a Minnie Mouse kitchen. As you all know, we live with my parents and my brother and sister. And they have kids and they have all these toys. So I figured we'd get her in the magic sink. You know, so this is like the one bedroom apartment version of <laughs> the kitchen. So yeah, and we'll teach her how to wash dishes. This came from Amazon today as well. Got Arthur some slippers because she just doesn't want to keep her shoes on, doesn't want to keep her socks on, and she's always putting on my slippers my little ratty tatty things so got her a pair of her own they're so cute with the little bunnies and again i got her purple because she said her favorite color is purple which is also my favorite color she's gonna be like me and got her for some sneakers these are the nike hirachi run se and the same with this one storm pink rust pink and white so yeah, we got her these. Which, oh, no shoelaces, you can just slide these on. And we got, I got her a size nine. She complains about her sevens hurting. These are probably gonna be a little um, too big right now, but yeah, those are her shoes. And she has one more pair coming. And I guess I'll show that to y'all later. All right, so now I can finally get to wrapping. And I might keep that box to wrap something just in case. I think I'm gonna keep that box to wrap this since it's not like perfectly square all right so i'm gonna move over to the open floor so i can wrap so i decided to wrap stuff to coordinate with the tree 
So this was downstairs, Black Santa. Duh. No brainer. And the edges aren't perfect like this one because we're human. My mom taught me to just fold it. And you'll always have a crisp, perfect line.